I mean, we will probably, this is probably going to be like our home, our safe area in our, uh, for our storage, and then we'll probably need to expand out around us for, uh, Like a safe yeah. place to store bits until Our we're ready. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, it's just so weird being able to look into it and knowing stuff's supposed to path through it. Yes, yeah, sort of like a shipyard or a scavenging yard of sorts. I mean, if we yeah. if we oh, get shit. to the point where we start downing ships, we could start scavenging off of them. We have enough power cells to fix this. There you go, Fuzz. Now you should be able to get both Not... the cryo and the survival oh, kit. It was it was already uh it was already working. It's just weird being able to see through it. Yeah, but now the uh, cryo bay is fully pressurized. Oh, it was before because I jumped in and I got pressured up. I think we found a glitch. Probably. Hang on a second. Oh. Am I still in creative? No. Okay. <laughs> Alright. So the battery that was damaged is back up. Yeah, there's just need steel plates. I think I have some of those on me. Nope, I do not. So. Got five batteries. That's pretty good. Not a bad little setup considering how we're having to do this. Yeah, no, I feel like we've done superbly well. Oh shit, the other door's completely done. What yeah. happened? Yeah, uh, Dano did it. Damn. I've been working on it all this time. <laughs> yeah. I see y'all. But yeah, I do feel like we should probably extend this just so it seals up. Just for prosperity. Prosperity? Prosperity's sake, yeah. Uh huh. It's what little tiny bit of OCD I have trying to kick in on me. It don't close completely, so it's starting to bug me a little bit. I want it like that. They can't get through, and we can shoot them through it. Uh, no, what up? What up? What up? What up? Hmm? It also doesn't interfere with the lightning bolts in the back when the doors are up. The what? When the doors are up, it doesn't interfere with the lightning rods on the back of the vehicle. Oh, those. Yeah, I didn't hear which. Uh, I didn't hear the lightning rods part. Yeah, sorry. But uh, yeah, no. When I when I stoop down to shoot out and pull the gun, I can't see out of it. No, dude. They run up there because you're tempting them with your meaty thighs oh, and then that's... and then you shoot them because they're thirsty spiders I hope that I was freaking on when I when that was said I would love to hear her reaction So, uh, Fuzz. Yep. You want to, uh, jump in your, uh, your rover and take a look at the other rover? Drive over to the other rover? Take a look at it? Let's rove. All right. Uh, should we grab some supplies before we take off? No, because really what we're doing is we're traveling a far enough distance that um, we could get 
four or five other ships spawning. Yeah. And we're just gonna we're gonna be looking at stuff. This is not this is not a uh, a working expedition. This is a scouting expedition. All right. Well, we got seats if y'all want to hop in. Just the three more door, four more doors left. That's basically motors and piston plates. Yep. Well, they can make while we're out. Yeah. Yes, the big rhino, uh, the big, uh, the, 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 the big river is the rhino. Uh, which way was the rhino? I turned my stuff off. There it is. Uh, back behind us over there. Once I'm able to finalize a sort of roof on this thing, we'll have an airtight place to hang out. Uh, thing yeah, you're gonna have to change that, uh, or just put a conjunction box, junction, whatever. Conjunction, and junction, what's your function? I've got no function. Are you conjunction, junction? Sometimes. You're bored, Daniel. Yeah, I'm on board. <coughs> oh, that was Fuzz's drop. Okay. Surprise is still there and hadn't exploded yet. Well, it's, you turned it off with the, uh, uh -oh. by collecting it. I gotcha. My headlights are on. Oh, that's freaky. What's that? Uh, the the desync between uh, the computer, the two machines. I occasionally see the tracks for this vehicle in front of it. Wow. The treads, like the yeah, the no, marks in the in the the sand. You see them pop up just before the vehicle gets close to that spot. Yep. You know, because normally it's you and Daniel who are riding and I'm the one driving, I haven't really gotten a chance to experience the ability to walk around in a rover. Yeah. This is smooth. Yes, it is. I hats off to him for getting to this point. Yeah. I I never thought this would have been possible. I remember some of the videos you guys initially put up for your single and then meeting co-op games when Planets first came out. That was rough. Yeah, a and little I bit. I think it was mostly the game's fault. <laughs> Well, uh, let's be let's let's be real here. It's usually the game's fault. Oh, we got a skimmer. Oh, that's closer. Yeah, let's hit the skimmer first. Yep. Just try not literally running into the skimmer first. Oh, come on, man. Oh, oh, that was more air than I wanted to catch in this big thing. I could see. Because my, the angle that I'm looking, uh, that's nickel. The the angle that I'm looking, that when you caught air and the nose tipped down, I actually lost sight of the rover. I was like, oh no, is he gonna flip over again? Again? Yeah. I ain't the one that flipped over to start with. What you talking about? <laughs> what you talking about, Willis? really don't want to hit some of these big hills. Yeah. You know, one of the things we're going to have to build to make this 
playthrough work, we're going to have to build a bridge that the rover, that the rhinos can cross over oh, the, the world scar. scar. Yes. Yeah. We're going to need a battery and a wind turbine or a solar panel, something mm -hmm. to keep power on the grid. Which means before we can get to the other half of the planet, we're going to have to build a vehicle that can take out that watchtower. Yep. Hey, we can convert the second Rhino into a uh, battle carrier. Yeah. Well, I, what I was thinking was building a... Uh, Looks like I have to go around these mountains. Basically turning it into a... Uh, a flatbed sort of thing and having a trailer on the back of it. Uh-huh. Like a, a large grid semi-truck. And building the launch ship off the top of the, the flatbed. Eh, maybe not I that. Think. But definitely turning the flatbed into a uh, a large grid item storage, and yeah. the 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 cab being like move the the survival kit forward. If we got yeah, like a that's all rough terrain. Yeah. All right. Yep. I may have just have to ease up and over. Yeah. Yeah. I think you will. I go to use the restroom, I'll be right back. Just take it slow. This thing should be big enough that it can handle most of this rough terrain. Yeah, just don't hit it too hard. It uh, goes nose first. Mm-hmm. I just hit a tree. We're standing it on its nose. <laughs> yeah, that's that's kind of what I meant. be just over the horizon. Mm -hmm. I'm going to turn my HUD off now. I just saw a peek over. Too small. I see that. What the heck is it? It's a skimmer. skimmer. Yeah, it just... I just was able to make it out. That has rocket launchers on it. Well, it's also a neutral, so... Don't think it's going to try and fight us. Rocket launchers. If it were going to shoot at us, it would have already been shooting. I really wish some of those things would drop out of the sky. This looks like a space station. Yeah, it do. It is a space station. 
well, it's called a skimmer, so it's probably intended to skim across the land, more like a hover thing. Here's a med bay, a cryopod. Fuck. Hey. There's the bridge. Ouch. Full functioning cryo uh, med bay. Yep. Well. Got it. Merge blocks. Not merge blocks, but uh, connectors. We've nice. got solar panels. Yep. I mean, that Blank in and of panels. itself, the solar panels are like, yes. I'm not sure how to get to the command room in there. Except for drilling through, but. What's upstairs? Uh, spits! Like a... oh. Hello, refineries. Refineries? Full, full sized refineries, yes. Four? Hello, who are you? Four. What are you? Okay. Two of, are, two of them are marked Tim Auto. Speed, oh. speed, conveyor. Oh, hello. Large reactor. Yield modules. Oh, oh this is a rover. This is a rover. What? It's got suspensions. This is a fucking rover. This ain't no goddamn station. This is a skimmer, baby. This is a rover. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll claim this one then as my rover. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Are they already going to grab the rhino as, to, yeah. as an extra on that thing? I'll take this. Yeah, no, I, I approve of that. <laughs> <laughs> this oh, is like a yeah, that's pretty good size. Where the hell's the suspensions at? Uh, probably underneath. Oh uh, no shit. Because I don't even think this is the bottom of it. Uh uh. Oh shit. Ah. Here's lights. I mean, I feel like I feel like the rusted part oh, just sticking out oh. over here is like the skirt of it. So I can't imagine it being too much bigger. Uh huh. Oh man, what a find! Yeah, magnesium on you. <laughs> yep. What a find. So Both armor blocks, Gatling turrets. Oh uh, yeah, I'm going to grab. Well, I guess. How oh, shit? I guess I have to go back and set up the. Uh, uh, the little rover, with a. Uh, 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 your your lifter carver thing. Uh. This thing has connectors on it, Fuzz. Yeah, lots yeah. of connectors. So what we do, we just, we land the, the, the worker with the drills on your, your truck, okay? Yeah. And if it needs to recharge, we just land it right here and dock up onto this. Yeah, I gotcha, I gotcha. I like this because you look down inside, that looks like the command room down in there with a huge freaking observation. <laughs> yeah. Do uh, move from current position. Skimmer. Alright. I like that it has actual solar panels on it. Yep. Always visible. Yeah, this thing's got a, a large reactor that just needs a little bit of work. Okay. And multiple large refineries, was it? Buzz? Yep. Four, yep, four of them. <laughs> yeah, I... This, this is a mobile base. Yep. Which, I mean, we can... The real question is... That drop. Is it? We really need to find another one. Yeah. Another skimmer. Yeah, because those refineries, I, th I almost think it'd be worth it to have. Have them linked up. 
well, have them moved off of the rover. Onto the base. Yeah. yeah. There's one of the large refineries right there. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to have to dig this out. So here's, here's my thought, okay? We have to dig this thing out. Then we're going to have to clear... Fuzz is going to have to go in and voxel hands out what we can't dig out. Right. We'll have to put wheels on it. Right. And then once we get it all done, Daniel's going to have to drive it out of the hole. Yep. 